Implication You've seen implication used all over the place in proofs, but do you understand it well? We'll consider two things which are obviously true. Let A be grass is green and B I am human. Let's start drawing a truth table. Consider true implies true. Does one true thing imply another true thing? If you're arguing that the grass is green, you may, in your next step of your argument, say that you are human. A does not cause B, but it still follows because B is true. Now, is true implies false valid? No. That's not allowed. Consider the grass is green implies I am not human. If you start arguing with something true, then use it to justify something you know is false, your argument is wrong. So true implies false is false. Now let's consider the case where you start off from a false statement. The truth table in your notes says false implies true is true. This does not make any sense. Why is this so? Let's take a false argument. Say 1 equals 0. You can easily prove that 2 equals 1. Using the same argument, you can prove that any number is equal to any other number. So you've just rendered the natural numbers meaningless. You can prove anything from a contradiction. This is the principle of explosion. Anything follows from a contradiction, whether it is true or false. So by this, we know false implies true, is true and false implies false is also true we've completed the truth table thank you for watching